Okay, first of all, we need to put on the backdrop fabric. Okay, and then use the hook like this on the stand. Okay, look, this is the hook like this. And then let's put on the shimmer wall panel. Just put the shimmer wall sample on the hook will be okay since I'm holding the uh, phone it's not convenient to show you the procedure I will show you the effect just put the uh, panel on the hook will be okay okay look this is the effect after I put on the shimmer wall okay then let's make our flower panel okay making the flower panel we need to use this plastic base or you can use this foam ball. Look at this, this foam ball. But I don't recommend to use this foam ball. I try to use it to insert the flower. Mm, feeling not good, but it works. It does work, but the feeling not good. Anyway, not recommend. Okay then. We use this foam ball, sorry, use this uh, plastic base. Look, they are spy on the base. So we can put our flower head on the spy. Put the flower head on the spy. Look, uh, since I already took the video tutorial to show you how to make the flower wall flower panel with this plastic bay i don't repeat the procedure here if you are interested to the step-by-step -step tutorial click here for the old tutorial and then i will show you the effect after i complete all the flower panel okay completed this is our flower panel look at this and then we need to Put on our love letter. I like to use our hook with B chain to adjust the length. Uh, you can use the string or fishing lines to tie on the uh, plastic bay will be okay, but I like to use this thing B chain and the hook. Okay then, let's put on the backdrop. Okay, put on the flower panel. I prefer to use this hook, but since I do not have enough hook on hand, so I will change to use this larger hook. And then I will use this bee chain. Uh, you can use the fishing lines by instead. I will show you the effect after I complete. And on the other end of the B chain, there's a little small hook to hold the plastic bag, the flower panel. I will show you the effect. Uh, luckily, the hook, the length of the hook just right suitable for me to hang up the flower panel. So I direct to hand the flower panel on the hook. Okay, now let's check the effect. Please do me a favor, but do not skip the advertisement because I want the revenue from YouTube to buy more material to make more video. Okay, then let's make the pedestal. Okay, I put the pedestal in front of the backdrop. Uh, in fact, if you want to uh, add in the pedestal, 
uh, we need to use a, make a larger backdrop. This special sample is a little bit small, not suitable for the idea. If your badge is small, like this sample, you don't have to use the pedestal. But anyway, let's go on. Okay, then let's make the flower arrangement like this. Let's check the effect. Look, this is the effect. Look, uh, if you are interested to watch the step-by-step -step tutorial about how to make the flower arrangement with the flower bowl, click here for the tutorial. I don't repeat on this video. Okay, let's check the whole effect. Okay, look, this is the whole effect. Uh, in fact, the come out will be much more pretty than what you watch from the screen. At least, the love letter will be much more clean, clear in reality. But I don't know why the camera cannot show the real effect. Okay, like this. Okay then, let's zoom in for the detail. Look, our flowers, our love letter, and our flower panel. Look. And again, um, if your petal is small, we don't have to use this pedestal and the flower bowl idea. If you are using a wider, larger uh, backdrop, putting the pedestal in the middle, the, the fabric, the place of the fabric, larger, wider, so the come out will be much more pretty. So. Uh, it depends the size of your backdrop. Okay, anyway. And okay, I'll show you the effect after I remove the pedestal. Okay, please don't skip the advertisement.